That's a Staraptor. Dude, how can you not? Guys, I don't have Pokeballs, I just realized. Pokemon Emerald Rogue is a game that combines roguelike elements with the Pokemon main games and it's super fun. You start a randomized adventure where you choose paths, catch Pokemon and build a team as you go with built-in permadeath and level caps similar to a Nuzlocke challenge. If a Pokemon faints, it gets removed from your team. If your team wipes, it's game over. I've decided to attempt all the monotype challenges, which means you're not allowed to start a battle if your whole team doesn't share a type. With that in mind, here are some extra rules I added to make it a little harder. Rare candies are banned. All gens 1 through 8 must be enabled. And Rainbow Mode is on, which means every Gym Leader and E4 can appear at any time, even as Champion. And X items are banned too. For this challenge's starter, I was just thinking what could be fun to use and I decided to go with Scyther, a fan favorite from Gen 1. What I really like about Scyther is that in Sword and Shield it received the move Dual Wing Beat, which is a 40 power 90 accuracy flying type move that hits twice. Combine that with Stab, Technician and maybe even a Choice Band and you have yourself a multi-hit move with an effective power of 270. Sounded pretty fun to me. What flying type starter would you use for this challenge? Let me know in the comments. If you like these kind of videos, don't forget to subscribe and here's how it went for me. But before you see Scyther's incredible performance, this video is sponsored by Sakura Ko and Toki Treat. Sakura Ko and Toki Treat are monthly Japanese snack subscription boxes delivered right to your door. With Sakura Ko, you will receive 20 traditional and authentic artisan Japanese snack items including exquisite Japanese teas and one special Japanese tableware with your box every month. Sakura Ko helps in partnering with local Japanese snack makers to continue to share Japanese culture and traditions that have been passed down for over 100 years. With Tokyo Treat, you will get up to 20 of the latest, most exclusive, limited edition and seasonal flavored Japanese snacks that are only available in Japan for a limited time, like Sakura Pepsi, Japanese Kit Kat flavors and many more. Each month's boxes comes with a new theme with all new snacks inside. This month's Sakura Ko theme is Festivals of Okinawa. Allow your imagination to experience the warmth of Okinawa's sunshine and its culinary treasures with these Okinawa special summer treats like Okinawan Salt Senbei, Pineapple Mochi Manju and Red Tomato Arara. All of this pairs excellently with this month's floral tea they included. Tokyo Treats theme this month is Fireworks Festival. Dive into this month's box filled with flavorful festival inspired treats like Salt Lemon Kit Kats, Salt Lemon Pretz. I don't think I've ever had any snack like that before. Or Sanpo Cotton Candy and prepare for a surprising twist with Mystery Flavored Fanta. Each box comes with a booklet that explains what snacks you're getting including allergen information and you can even learn a little bit about Japanese culture. If you want to experience a little bit of Japan yourself, get these boxes and use my code CHRISM at checkout and you will save $5 on your first box. Every purchase of Sakura Ko and Tokyo Tree directly supports the channel, so please click the link in the description to get your first box today. Thanks again Sakura Ko and Tokyo Tree for sponsoring today's video. Alright, we're starting the monotype challenge for flying and we're having fun because we're using a Scyther. Isn't that a fun Pokemon? Wouldn't you say that's a fan favorite? We go Jolly, uh, Technician, Dual Wing Beat, Coarse, Verdant, Rugged, Swarming, Bre oh, Breezy, I mean Breezy is confirmed flying types. Yeah, I gotta do that, I gotta do that. Starting with a tough route, let's go. Does this fly? That's right, Scyther only challenge. Give me that. Don't miss Dual Wing Beat challenge, but if we do miss, we just use a different Scyther because we have six of them. Ah, miss dual wing bead? No problem. I got a backup Scyther. There they are. A whole swarm. Good offense. Good offense. Okay. Terrible speed. You're terrible too. I'm gonna replace the bottom two. I'm gonna get some good Scythers. Alright. The army is ready. This was coincidence, by the way. I mean, obviously, I couldn't have known that Scyther would show up in the wild. On the run that I'm using Scyther as my starter. Scyther is my favorite fall swiper. What is yours? Put your answer in the comments below. Yeah, it was it was Eviolite. We used Eviolite, and I'm like, hmm, what's your favorite Eviolite user? And a lot of people commented. It was actually kind of interesting to see all the different responses. So now we get to hear about their favorite fall swiper. If we win this. If we win this. Okay. <laughs> I really want to keep them all alive. I'm going to give every Scyther a, uh, a sash. I think this is too good of a meme opportunity to say no to. We're going to try to keep all Scythers alive. Oh, I forgot to teach Fury, Fury Cutter to my starter. Dude, you think I'm gonna catch Pokemon? <laughs> I'm just gonna go to the game show, deny. We're just gonna rush to the end. What is the point of even checking wilds when we have six Scythers? Oh, by the way, the, the water encounters. Lotad and... It, oh, we could have a Raccoonid. What's the other one? Oh wait, we're doing normal type. Bro, there's no normal... No, we're doing flying type. 
I'm just very confused today. We could have Wingo. Is there any others? Well, we didn't get it anyway. Wingal could have been it. Gyarados doesn't show up in the wild. I'm concerned about Waheyman. He hasn't been seen in like 20 rooms. Erica, mm. I'm so sorry. She doesn't know what's about to happen. There's the miss. Still alive. I actually, I need to visit the, the rest stop with the tutors so I can prepare the other Scythers for battle. We haven't done that yet. Morty. I actually lost one. <coughs> Don't miss do a wing bee challenge. Reversal. The ghost? It did get sneak. Okay. <sighs> Almost lost our best Scyther. At plus four, neutral damage, 60 power, stab, fury cutter. It's more accurate, right? Yes, it is. Uh, well, we're definitely going for the legendary, duh. Wait. But that would mean I have to replace a Scyther. <gasps> Maybe I'll just leave. <laughs> I still have not fixed the movesets on the other Scythers. But, I mean, they're, they're like, okay, naturally okay. Oh, Chuck? Chuck's fine. Ah, oh, man, we're getting so many of the easy fights early. Wow, I missed twice, but I'm still living. Let's go. All right, we're here. Well, hey, guy, still hasn't been seen in forever. This one is gonna keep Swarm, okay? We're gonna activate the Focus Sash with the Sword Stance, and then we have Swarm, Excisor, and Reversal. So I'm gonna teach over Night Slash. I'm gonna teach Sword Stance over Night Slash on the bottom one. I think the biggest threat we have in this run is Sandstorm. <laughs> Sandstorm's gonna ruin us. Sandstorm and Heyo. The Rock-type trainers, they're gonna be the toughest ones for sure. All right, Blaine. Sunlight is strong. Uh, do I a sword stance or do I just attack? I think I have to sword stance here, right? Flareon's a little too tanky. Ah, oh, actually, Flareon only has 60 defense. Does Flareon go down to do a windy? Oh. <laughs> That's so bad. 135 defense on Turdenata. With the sword stance, it might be a, we might be able to one-shot it with dual wing bead. So I'm gonna sword stance. We'll see we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Reversal. After a sword stance. If, you, if I compare the damage range to the Flareon. And dual wing beat is 180 power. Reversal is 200 power, so it's slightly stronger. And we have double attack now. This should go down. This should go down. IMO. It might be close though. Reversal. Mega camera up this less bulky than Ferdinand. Scythed. Dude, I think my game's broken. Like, where did Wahei guy go? Uh, Salamence Selim site. Oh yeah, Mega Salamence would have been a great Pokemon to use. <laughs> oh wait, we can't. It would have to be Bagon. 
We would have to catch a Salamence. Watson is a problem. Watson could be a big problem, especially if we get status. Pachirizu. Alright, I'm going to Sword Stance. Toxic. Dual Wing Beat is my strongest move here. At plus one. Rotom. I think Rotom lives. At, at plus two. Oh, only 50 HP though. Hmm. I can full restore, and then it, we will be down to 1 HP after its move, right? It, it, reversal would be a better range to one shot. So that's definitely better. So I'm, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna heal until it misses a move or crits us with our para. All right, I think I have to go for it. This is, this is it. I'm pretty sure this is a range. Hey man. If it, if it has to end like this, then it, it is what it is. Hate to see it. First Scythe down. The meme's over. We can find a PC. We can find a PC. How do we know it's the right Scythe, though? This lives. Oh, <gasps> wait, I can, I can hard switch to, to one with reversal. And then maybe I can one-shot it. It can get sturdy. Ooh. No, reversal is guaranteed actually. Okay, 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 okay. So we should go this one. Reversal. That was it, it was just, it lived. It just naturally survived. Damn. That is such a shame. Ah, if I used this one, it, it would have died. God damn it. It didn't trigger the sash, so we actually survive. Damn, did we lose two or three here? That is such a shame. We lost two. Meme's over. Okay, I'm checking the wilds for flying types. <laughs> I mean... What? Hey, guy, is still gone. I, th I legit think my game's broken. I should have, like, restart it. <laughs> you know what? We have to... We should teach dual wing beat to Scyther. <laughs> just, make, just makes sense, right? I guess Dragonite can have it, too. Liza. Should be free. Isn't it faster than me? No, I should be faster. I'm just gonna exit on this one. We can set up on something else. I'll sword stance here. And now it should be a free fight, right? We could get outsped by like a scarf. Oh, that's it. GG. Ah, I should dual wing beat would have killed too. I would never go for that though, unless I knew, because I don't want to miss. <laughs> God damn it. See? That's fine. Reflect is still on. Isn't Mime's defense really bad? We're down to two. This is so sad. Uh, fierce, magical, sharp. I, I might go to sharp and just check for wilds. 
Our brawler, Mandy Bus. Welcome to the team. Two more. Sableye. Dunsparce. Dunsparce has wings, does that count? I was so ready for Dunsparce to get an evolution for like years. What I was expecting it to bloom, you know, and turn into like a dragon. A normal dragon type. And like a, like a giant monster. And, and then they just did the Dunsparce. Hello. I've missed you. You've been gone for so long. Please give me a Scyther. Please, please, please. Clobopus. Damn. It's uh, Claire. Claire. Ooh. Claire has, is a very scary trainer. She has lots of strong Pokemon. Drudigon. Does Drudigon have rough skin? Nope. Mold Breaker. Okay. Uh, sword Stance. That's fine. I'm just gonna... Just gonna heal that. You bitch. Alright, Dragonite it is. That's so mean! It's gonna use Dragon Tail. So I can't set up. I can just raw outrage it. Whatever. Draco Meteor. Very likely. Uh, I'm gonna full restore. Outraged, okay. It does double damage now, so that's a range to kill, probably. Favorable range to kill me. Mm, I'm gonna wait for confusion. Which means I can't set up. Oh, wait, no, I could. I'll outspeed after I one Dragon Dance. Dude, I, 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 I don't like fishing for... Confusion damage, but I don't know what else I would do here, and I really want to win, so. Hey, let's go. Okay, I'm definitely going for the Dragon Dance then. Dragon Dance. Now I'm faster, unless it's Choice Scarfed. Outrage. Not Scarfed. Uh oh. This should go down though, right? E4 members next. Uh, yeah, I mean, we have nothing else to prepare. And we're going with the Reversal Scyther. Yeah, Reversal Scyther in the lead. Versus Norman. I wish I had the Brick Break one in the lead now. Lissy lead. A yo, Source Sense. Free Source Sense. Into Exodor. Goes down. I might not be faster. Oh, it's gonna come down to stats, like the, the EV stuff. 21. Mm, I don't think I'm faster then. I am faster, but I missed my move. Okay, no punny sucks. Good to know. Do we, do we think reversal is strong enough now? Oh, if it has Fluffy, it lives. Yes, that's true. Actually, I'm gonna heal here. I might be able to get down to max damage reversal. Or just do this, okay? Snorlax. Oh! I should have stayed low HP! Going it. No! Belly drum? No problem. Legendary. And chance for Deli Bird. I mean, why wouldn't we go here? Beauty Fly. Okay, welcome to the team. Do I keep Beauty Fly or do I Wahe? I don't know, guys. I think Beautify is kind of cracked. 90 special- 100 special attack on Beautify with Quiver Dance. How is that not good? No, I, I think le it's legit good, guys. It's, it's, it's good. It's a, it would be such a waste to- Hey, we, we're, so, we're so far in, man. 
trade the Mandy bus then? What? No! Massive Al, stop judging me, please. Koga. Poison point is very scary. I don't want to set up on that. Oh, Sheer Force is likely. Sheer Force is likely. So I can do Sword Stance into Dual Wing Beat. Didn't miss. Let's go. Beedrill. Beedrill has a Sash. Dual Wing Beat. Oh, not this one. Never mind. This is a Mega. <gasps> I'm dead. It outspeeds me. Unless... Beedrills are usually a Tailwind with a Sash. I mean, the go-to would be Reversal here, right? Would Nihilego go down at plus two? Oh, yeah. Reversal. It, uh, it's, uh, it's Scarfed. It's Scarfed, guys. Yeah, there, look at that. Oh, I could have danced for free then. I knew it was Scarfed. This could have been Sashed. I think it usually is. But dual wing beats, good. Nice. Good fight. Alright, we have to keep in mind that Nihi Legos might be scarfed in the future. We're down to our last cypher. Man. Corrosive. I mean I have a I have a free slot, I might as well. I might as well, you yeah. know. I mean that's uh, that's a flying type. What's coming up? Well, hay is coming up. Okay, I got I got the two cannon to max level. I, I I think I'll keep it. I'm not actually gonna going to Wahei it. Fierce. I mean, it's a calm round, right? As well. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Let's go. I think I have a I think I have a Salamence Mega Stone too. Don't I? I do. Let's go. What what do I get rid of though? <laughs> Cannon's trash. Okay. This one, this one's great too. Hell yeah. Oh, I can't wait for the YouTube comments. Oh, Mega Celements is so OP. This is not even fun to watch, man. <laughs> oh, I mean, I guess we could get multiple Celements. I didn't really think about that. I only have heal balls though. I, I actually think we should, yeah. We can replace the Mandy bus. There's no shot Celements isn't worth. Oh, okay, never mind. I, I speed up wins. <laughs> ah, Dragon Dance, of course. We still have a Cypher. We still have one, man. Okay, I'm gonna lead. I'm gonna lead. Uh, I'm gonna lead this Dragonite. Uh, oh, Beautifly isn't even done. Oh my goodness. How could I forget to prepare Beautifly? Where? Does it not get Air Slash? What? Air Cutter. That's it. It's just Air Cutter. Oh, that's lame. Wait, nature check. Oh, this one's adamant. That's wrong. Oh, that's wrong too. Oh no, that's right. Man, the prep always gets so long at the end. End game. Yeah, I'm leading Dragonite because Elements isn't leveled yet. Annabelle. Annabelle's fairy. GG. Missed dual wing beat. Try again. What item do you think? If this thing doesn't have a sash, you gift a sub? <laughs> okay, sure. Dual wing beat. It didn't have a sash. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude, I don't know if Weezing would survive Iron Head. It's kind of tanky. But I'm plus one. I'll just heal. What's going on? I'm gonna live a hidden. Oh, I might live Strange Steam actually. Alright, I just got Iron Heart. Nice. I'm gonna heal. Just to see what's up. I would live an Ice Beam. Alright. That didn't do anything. Dual Wing Beat. Kills. Dual wing beat's my strongest move. I'm not quite sure if Iron Head would kill. I think Bulu is tanky, right? Yeah. Missed. <gasps> Why? Oh. 
I deserve that. Because I did not deserve to miss dueling me. That's, that's all I'm saying. Alright. We lost a Dragonite. So are we going up here and we get Earthquake for Salamence and Dragonite? Or do we go here and get a potential sixth member of the DK crew? And this would also give levels, actually. I'm going here. We're skipping Earthquake, which is rough. That's a Staraptor. Dude, how can you not? Guys, I don't have Pokeballs, I just realized. I have six heal balls. Oh, I ran! Oh my god, I'm actually throwing. No, that was such a good Pokemon. I mashed B. Ugh. What is this? That was a throw. Oh, that was such a throw. Now I don't get bad. I mean, I get the level still. Hey, man, we got Cramorant, though. <laughs> I mean. Okay, nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Uh, we'll use this as a special attacker. So we go, we go Surf. I think you can do both. I can't believe I ran from Seraptor. It was honestly a mistake. I did not mean to run from that. Staraptor is really good. Ah, <laughs> oh, well. Uh, I guess we'll eat Salamence. Even though it, it's Brick Break and not... Yeah. It's, I think Salamence is the right lead. It's okay, we have Cramorant. Yeah, true. Cramorant, Cramorant's just as good as Staraptor. Price. Why? That's <laughs> so bad. Oh no. Wait, should I just Mega Brick Break? I don't, I don't know if it has uh, a Sash though. I don't think it does usually. It was Sash, so it's not Scarfed, which means I'm still faster. Do you think I would survive Blizzard? Probably not, yeah. I could go Mandy Bus. Mandy Bus is kind of safe. I could I could knock it out too, and then we'll we'll go we'll see from there. But I would probably have to switch on the second Pokemon. And Aurora's doesn't seem so scary. That's why I want to switch now. I'm switching to Mandy Bus. I'm switching. Did go for Blizzard. Uh, yeah, Mandy Bus has an Assault Vest. And it's like naturally bulky. So Blizzard doesn't do much. It still hurts. <sighs> we might have to sack. Salamence will never be able to set up. Dragonite can set up guaranteed. And the Scytha too. The Scythe I can probably sweep with a reversal, guys. Sec, Cram, Mandy's too good. Ooh, that's a spicy opinion. I don't know about that. No, you're right, though. Mandy Bus has all the, the, the EVs from the whole run, and Cramorant doesn't. So if we sacrifice anything, it should be it should be the, the, the Cram. Ah, oh, the gold missile didn't activate. What? Dance? Huh? Iron Head kills. If it does have slush rush, like triple axle, then we might actually just lose. Oh, Aurora Veal. Aurora Veal, okay. Yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty scary. I, I want to know what it goes for next. Icicle Crash. Okay, that would kill me for sure. I mean, what, what do we do? I could hope for a miss, but then the hail hits me. And I would go down after if I don't, if I don't one-shot it. And I won't because the Aurora Veil's up. But what we could do is we can heal until the Aurora, v Aurora Veil runs out and then attack, which is a risky turn. But if it goes for Aurora Veil, then at least we got some damage off. I think that's the play. It must have light play, right? Yeah. All right, I'm definitely not stalling another Veil. Absolutely not. I'm attacking now. Flinch. Ah, come on, man. I would have to stall eight more turns, and I'm, I'm actually like running short on full restore. Do I just spam eight more full restores? That's kind of lame. We already lost Crab Red. Mandy might live an icicle crash. Uh, I don't think it would. I don't think it would. Uh, maybe actually. I'm, I'm doing it. I'm, I'm not gonna spam eight more full restores. I'm switching. I'm switching. 
Tanked. Okay. Barely. We don't take... I'm definitely healing that, though. I could foul play. Wait, why did it do over half this time? Oh, no. <laughs> it's a range. <laughs> one more. One more. For a better roll. That was worse. Foul play doesn't kill unless it crits. Now who's PP stalling? Oh my god, man. It didn't have to be like this. Crit me. I dare you. It did. <laughs> it did just with the wrong one. Dude, we're running really low on force run. I'm winning this. Dude, the, the, the Scythe at the beginning was so good. I really want this to make it to YouTube. This would be so sick. Okay. Ah, there's the veil again. Should have attacked. I should have attacked. I'm throwing. Who's that heal? Kratos. You're banned. I'm just kidding. Knock off. I'm dead. Never mind. I mean, that means it's not going to do much damage. Dragonite would want it KO. Yeah, we could hard switch to Dragonite and then uh, Iron Head. God damn. That's a defense monster. It's not over yet. I think we have to sack something. And the only other thing I can sack is Beautifly. Actually, Beautifly might one-shot it with the uh, Bug Buzz, so here we go. Actually, no, I'm gonna die to Hale. <laughs> you know, the, the, the constant weather in this game, no matter what you're using, is so annoying. Okay, I said it. It's stupid. Do we think Iron Head would two-shot? Without setup? Iron Head. Life Orb killed me. I forgot about the Life Orb. Okay, I'm gonna Outrage. Damn. Damn, that was a tough one. Hey, but it's fine. Scyther is still with us. Two fights to go. I gotta go down, right? I gotta go check out the route. Oh, if I go to the route, then I can't- I still can't get Earthquake on Salamence. If I go up here, I can. If I go down here and do the fight, I can as well. But the route could give us four more Pokemon. Route and potions is good too. Mighty. Ah, uh, we're doing the route. Okay, we got our Wahey material. And he's here. Let's go. Come on. Skiddo. Oh god, the song. The song. It's Faulkner, by the way. Faulkner, flying types, flying types, flying types. It's like worst case scenario, man. I, I mean, at least we did that, right? So I'm gonna dance on, on Corviknight. What is he gonna do? Brave Bird. Intimidated Brave Bird critical. All right, all right, all right. That shouldn't do too much. I forgot to Mega on the Dragon Dance. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I forgot. Uh, which gives us extra defense, right? So I'm gonna I'm gonna mega dragon dance now. Um, but I think it would have whirlwinded us already, if that's the case. So I'm gonna go to plus four. It you turned out. Okay. That should be fine though. Okay, thunderous, electric flying. I'm going for it. Yeah. Oh I, I mean, I don't think the crit mattered. I think this would have gone down. It's quite frail. Okay. Three extra levels, that's huge. Sigilith. Should go down. <laughs> Ivelta. Should go down. And then the Corviknight, which I'm probably gonna outrage. Was that the last Pokemon? I think it was. Oh, it's not? I almost threw. I almost would have outraged the Crobat. Oh my god, could you imagine how stupid I would look?
Oh, yes. Route plus legendary? We are definitely gonna do that. I forgot to buy balls. Again. Ooh, it's a tough route right before the final fight of the game. Like, these are gonna be level 100 trainers. This is very scary. No, it's a forced fight. <laughs> Wait, it's not. It's a spinner. I would do a Wahei catch at the very least. I mean, no, 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 the legendary is coming up, right? So we'll catch the legendary <laughs> no matter what. Okay, then. <laughs> Good luck, me. What? I think I soft blocked. Oh my god. I've never seen that. That's so scary. So we do legendary. Wait, 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 wait a second, chat. Legendary has a tough fight before, and then it's gonna be like almost impossible to catch. But the bush doesn't have a fight, and I can catch it for the Wahei. And it could be a flying type. Like the I think the bush is actually better. Uh fine content. What gen is this before I risk it? Ultra Beast. Tapu Fini. So you expect me to stay in against Misty Search Tapu Fini and try to catch that? You're out of your mind. <laughs> oh, it doesn't work. Half. It doesn't work. Half. Okay, if it goes for Hydro Pump again. Nature's Man is always does 50. Oh, there we go, there we go. I get to weaken it. Oh, good defense. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna heal and then Exazor, and it should be Red Buff. You say Nature Madness always has 50, so I can just uh, I can just stay. Muddy Water. This is just for Wahei chance, by the way. He might not even be there. My last ball. over. Alright, good try, good try, good try. Alright, final fight coming up. Oh, he's here too. Yo, what if we... I should wahey the Salamence. What if it's Rayquaza? <laughs> Alright, I mean, I'm gonna leave the movesets as they are. If anything, I would teach Return over Body Slam, if we think it's stronger, but I'm not sure. We didn't have the Salamence, like, the whole time. It's pretty recent. I don't- I just don't want sand or hail. Ah, because with sand, the Scyther is losing so much of its power. Come on, here we go. It's red. Oh, no sand. Let's go. Alright, then I gotta- I gotta meet the song, sorry. It's not always red, no. Persian? Oh my god. Dragon dance. Dragon dance. Parting shot. Okay, so basically nothing happened here. Dragapult comes out. Do I outspeed Dragapult? And do I live Dragon Darts? I might live Dragon Darts. I'm plus one speed. Oh yeah, I'm plus one speed. Oh yeah, I I'm definitely outspeeding them. Okay. Uh, I can outrage, that kills for sure. I can... I can body slam, which I don't think would kill. Uh, I mean, outrage is kind of good. I do lock myself, but if once we're confused, I can heal. But I, in between, I cannot. So risky. Outrage. I'm doing it. Unboosted outrage. Tapu. Of course. So he gets a free. They get a free hit now. Volt switch. Blaze Fallon. And I'm not confused. I should be able to use Earthquake this, right? I mean, this, I don't think this survives. 
They are often specs. So we, what it, we, we're, yeah, yeah, I think you're right. We're expecting a specs shadow ball. Earthquake. Goes down, nut sash. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Tapu Koko comes back in. It volt switched earlier, which could give us a free heal. Or we do an unboosted earthquake on that one as well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for earthquake. Heliolisk. I'm gonna go for Earthquake. Goes down, goes down, goes down. Don't, that's a weird team for red. Two Pokemon to go. One of them is Persian. Jellicent. We can body slam this or outrage. And we since we know the last is Persian, we can just outrage. Unboosted. Outrage. Goes down! Let's go! Expected fake out into outrage. GG, let's go. The Scyther made it. One of them, one of the Scythers made it to the end as well. All right, put the music back on. GG, flying type beaten with the Scyther mean. Hell yeah, unboosted sweep. Scyther, we started with Scyther, but not this one. This is one we caught. Check out my other Emerald Rogue videos. I put a link to the playlist in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and bye-bye.